Hello, my name is Garth Warner Sr., Chief Operating Officer of Curtis Hudson Holdings, LLC. We are the inventors of the Hudson ID Visor. Our product has a registered trademark and it has a patent pending. We are also endorsed by both law enforcement and civilians alike as a product that promotes safety and helps save lives during traffic stops. It is important to note that we've been working on this product since 2015. We have tested in all automobiles and we are here to verify that it is compliant in all 50 states. Now let's take a look at our solution. Okay, so this is your Hudson ID visor and this is how it will arrive. It comes in a clear sealed plastic pouch. What you want to do is take the visor out of the pouch and all of its contents. Contents are three items. You have your visor. In the back pocket is your instruction card. And you have this Velcro strap. So I'm going to put these aside for one second. Now I'm going to reach into my wallet and I'm going to pull out my driver's license. And for you, we would recommend that you get a duplicate copy of your driver's license to use in your visor from the DMV. Okay, now that those are all aside, and as you can see, I had to reach into my glove box. With the Hudson ID visor, you no longer have to do that. So here's the visor, and you'll notice on the front, there are three pockets. In one of these pockets, I will put my driver's license. In the other pocket, I will put my insurance card. And in the third pocket, for those of you that have a license to carry, you can put that there, any medical ID or any other type of information that you feel will help you remain safe when being stopped by law enforcement. In the back pocket, this sleeve here is, as we saw before, full length. And as you get your visor, you'll notice that the plastic is a little tight, so it may take a few moments to loosen it to put your registration in the back pocket. So bear with me. And there we have the registration and so forth now installed in the Hudson ID visor. Now what we want to do again is just put this aside for one moment. This Velcro strap becomes very important. And the Velcro strap is what we use to help secure the Hudson ID visor on your actual car's auto visor. So what we want to do first, let's pull down the visor. If your car has a clip, let's unclip that visor. And let's take the strap apart with the Velcro side showing. So what you want to do is secure your visor in place. And as you secure it, make sure that there is enough give, so put two fingers in there, so that you can place your Hudson ID visor on the opposite side. So now let's pull back down, and let's take our visor itself, and let's slide it through. And what you notice here is that this car happens to have a mirror. And when you have a mirror, basically with this strap, you can pretty much slide over your visor, and in this case it's not tight enough, so let's tighten it a little bit more, now that our visor's in place. And you can see that it will hold right in place there. And the other important thing, as I'm showing you this, is that when, the con when you have contents inside the plastic sleeve visor, it remains secure and flat. Okay, very important to note. Okay, so now I'll position it back in the middle, and I will close it up, and if you'll notice, the Hudson ID visor, white letters, appear very clear. So in the evening, when law enforcement is stopping you, your hands are always visible, and most important, they see that this is a visor in which you're reaching. So therefore, you're pulling down, and you're very easily giving to law enforcement all the documents that they need for a successful traffic stop.